the Mirror Chase Handicap is next. This is a two mile 0 to 140. And at the top, we've got Gariba for Martin Leland, the handsome Dan, Joshua Sutherland, Templar Knight, Daniel French, you greet for Graham Clutterbuck, Excelsior Parade, Jim Murray, San Pedro Tinker, Vinnie Gerard, Santos Trooper, James Shea, Buckhouse, John Morgan, Chardonnay Trail, James Shea, Hall of Fame, Derek Hinton, Lamarita Buff for Matt Cooper, and Green Tie for Derek Hinton as well. A figure of 12 in this one. Away and racing. And heading towards the first of the fences in this two miler. 13 to take. And over the first again. There's one down already. Buckhouse is gone. John Morgan, what are you doing? Calling a horse that keeps falling. Buckhouse. Presume he didn't keep doing that when he was shining it, otherwise he'd have probably called it something else. But anyway, there you go, they're over that one as well. They're going towards the second. Maybe he'll get himself on a decent handicap mark for the grand annual at Cheltenham if it keeps falling over. Anyway, the handsome Dan is in the lead. Green tie is in second. Excelsior Parade is third. We're down on the inside of the Templar Knight. Also San Pedro Tinker is up there as they get two to third and the leader made a mistake this time. Joshua Sutherland's handsome Dan was anything but handsome at that one as they get to the fourth and there's another one down there and it's hall of fame who's gone so hall of fame will not be heading to the hall of fame if it keeps jumping like that and it's out of this one but derek to the horse green tie is in the lead as they get to the fifth stood off at the leader but got over it nicely Gareeba with the top weights move through on the inside of also on the inside of that one is the gray excelsior parade for jim murray who's got a lot of grays this season in towards the back, he greet is the back marker for Graham Clutterbuck. The top white made the mistake there. Gariba has dropped right to the back. He can't afford to make mistakes in these fast two milers, and they're not hanging a bit. It's difficult to make the ground back up again. And Santa's trooper has got into the lead. Chardonnay trying his second to James Shales. Look at that loose horse motoring along in third. That's Buck House, and can obviously run. Don't seem to be able to jump as they get to the next. And over that one, both of James Shea's horses made a mistake. And now on the inside, Templar Knight's gone back on again. Gariba's been allowed to get back into contention. Green Tie's still there, so is Excelsior Parade. The handsome Dan has dropped right to the back, and he's running quite wide on the track as well. As they go past the seven furlong mark already, and Templar Knight is in the lead. From Gariba and Green Tie, then Excelsior Parade on the inside. Lamarita Bus is close up. Handsome Dan has now got a run through as the top weight Gariba takes it up, but is immediately pressed by Green Tie, and they're queuing up behind to challenge. But Gariba has got a marginal lead of oh, about a length or so at the moment. On the wide outside, the Handsome Dan, who might just get affected by that loose horse on this turn. In fact, it is pushing him out a little bit further than he would want to go. I think at the moment, but now on the inside, Excelsior Parade's come up to challenge for the lead. Gariba and Excelsior Parade then from Handsome Dan wide on the track. Templar Knight is now out of it. Lamarita buffs his neck. He greet. He's running on really well around the outside and has now stormed through the challenge for the lead. He greet, who's not been around since she was a four year old, I don't think, skips over the third last. And he's now gone two lengths clear of Excelsior Parade in second. Top weight Gariba trying to stick on under the big weight. So too Handsome Dan. Then Chardonnay Trail is after that one. They've got two to get over. And he Greet is in the lead, but Excelsior Parade is fighting back on the inside. Gariba still back there in third, also Templar Knight over the second last they go, and it's Excelsior Parade, who looks the strongest at the moment, clear of Templar Knight. The weight's telling on the top two, but it's Excelsior Parade who's clear of Templar Knight. Over the final fence they go, and it's Excelsior Parade who's well clear, and he's going to take this for Jim Murray. Templar Knight's going to run on to be second, close for third, Lamarie to Green Greentide, and the handsome Dan. And all the way back to the Greek team, flattered to deceive on the turn. Jim Murray's great, has taken that one pretty cleverly, pretty cosily as well. Wins it by three leads. So, Excelsior Parade for Jim Murray, the winner. Templar Knight, Daniel French, second. Lamarita Boss, Matt Cooper, third. Green Tie for Derek Hinton was fourth. And the handsome Dan for Joshua Sutherland was back in fifth.